Today, we'll be showing you how to backup footage from your Avicon DVR slash MVR in private format. You will need the listed items to proceed. An Avicon recorder that is an AVR HT model or an NT model, NN model or HN model, a mouse, a monitor, and a USB thumb drive. Insert the USB thumb drive into your Avicon recorder. Click the start icon, then select search and backup. You will be redirected to the search and backup section and be welcomed to multiple backup option. For this video, we'll be showing you the by time option. Select the by time tab. Click on any of the windows with the plus icon below the timeline. Select all the cameras you wish to perform a backup on, then click Add. Your timeline should now be populated with data that is stored on the hard drive disk. Using the calendar window on the top, you can select the desired date to retrieve archive footage. From here, you can select from the timeline with two options. One option is to click on the set backup time to select a specific time frame to be backed up. Another option is to use your mouse and highlight the desired portion of the timeline to back up. Once you have made your selection, you may select the backup button at the bottom of your screen. Your USB drive that you have inserted into the recorder should now be selected automatically. If not, manually select it from the drop down menu. If you do not see your USB thumb drive, please format it as a file system FAT32 on the Windows computer. Click the Format drop-down menu and there will be three file types to select from, MP4, AVI, and Private. Please note, some recorders may not have the MP4 option based on the model number or by limited support by the firmware version. Select the Format Private. Once clicking the backup button, a pop-up window will appear. From here, you may choose to have the encryption or no encryption. If encrypting, enter a password and have it saved for later on. If no encryption is necessary, select the no encryption option. Once your selection has been made, press OK and the backup process will begin. This would take a moment. Once the backup is completed, you can remove the USB thumb drive from the recorder. To view the footage that you have backup, insert the USB thumb drive into a PC and use the Includer RPass player to play the saved footage. Keep in mind that you must extract the RPass zip folder to be able to use the RPass player. Run the RPass player program. Select on the Open Folder button. A pop-up window will appear. From there, navigate to the USB drive and select the folder where you back up your footage onto. Once done, the pop-up window will close and you should now see the folder that contains your backup footage. Select the footage you would like to view. If you add encryption to your backup earlier in the video, enter the password, then press OK. And now you're all set. You can now view the footage that you have backup earlier from your recorder. That's it for this one. We hope this tutorial was helpful. Thank you for watching.